We're inside the organ chamber in this video. This is one part of the church that very few people have ever seen. We are underneath where the pipe work is, but there's a few things here that I can show you. That is one of the reservoirs. It holds air at a particular set pressure. This is another one. And as you can see, there is lots of tubing carrying air to different parts of the organ. There's not a ton of room up here. On this back wall, or the, actually the side wall, are some of the pipes of the pedal reed. That's the 32 foot portion and the rest of them are back here. Also at the very back of the chamber is what is called the 16 foot principal. And these pipes are so long that they have to be mitered. That means they go up so far and then they're cut in two and placed back together and actually the lowest pipes point downward. Those are the ones that are mitered. Here are the chimes. And then we'll make our way back over to the other side and I'll show you the panel for the solid state control system before we go up and take a look at the pipe work. So that's part of the solid state system. Lots of circuitry and there's a fair amount of wiring in this organ. Now, I'm gonna pause for just a second while I climb the short ladder up to where the pipe work is. Well, actually, I will just leave it running for a second. So now we're up in the main part of the organ. This pipe work that you're seeing now is part of the great division. There's the view from the chambers looking out into the sanctuary. The pipe work down here is some of the pedal division pipe work. Although it's dark, I'm not sure if you can see, those are some of the uh, wooden pedal pipes. And remember I told you in the other video that two of the portions of the organ or divisions are enclosed in boxes. Well, this is the swell division and you can see the louvers that I talked about that open and close, letting uh, more sound out or more sound in. And we can actually open up the door to the swell division and you can see that inside there is all of the pipe work that makes up the swell division. On the other side is another chamber just like this where the positive 
division is located. If you ever wondered how a pipe is tuned, most of them are tuned by moving a cap at the top of the pipe up or down in the least tiniest bit of movement, but you're actually shortening or lengthening the pipe to bring it back to perfect pitch. Some pipes have stopped are stopped at the top. That entire cap moves up and down when it's being tuned. And the reeds, which you really can't see in this, um, are tuned in a very different way. But when the tuner comes, each pipe is checked for tune. And there are 2,899 individual pipes in this instrument. Now I'm gonna go back down the ladder and I'll try to show you a better view of the swell and positive enclosure. we can see around here. There's the tonal openings or the shutters for the positive and the light color and the um, swell which dates back to 73 that's painted that dark color but um, you can see the other enclosure much better. I mentioned just a minute ago about reed pipes being tuned differently this is a reed pipe in the pedal, and that little wire is what is moved up and down to tune these type of pipes. So that's some pictures from the chamber. Hope you enjoyed it.